Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be talking about the most difficult and rare shiny Tenorians to find inside of Tales of Tenorio. So, let's get straight into the video. So, the first Tenorians I would like to talk about are the shiny starters. There are currently only two ways to get them. You can either shiny reset for them at the start of the game, or hunt them with conservation incenses, which are a rare drop from ruptures, or you can buy them with 250 robux, and last for 10 minutes each. So, overall, a pretty difficult hunt here for some pretty exclusive and cool Tenorians you're gonna want. The next Tenorian I would like to talk about is Shiny Four Drake. Now, Shiny Four Drake's base odds are 1 in 200,000 as it is a 1% chance to find inside of the mine depths and you cannot get overworld encounters of it so you have to kind of rely on quite a lot of luck to even find one in the first place however on the flip side shiny four drake at maximum odds is only 1 in 25,600 chance and arguably has the best shiny in the whole game the black and gold is absolutely stunning the next Tenorian I'm going to talk about, and you probably don't even know it exists, is a Sarachnid that is level 40 that spawns here in Whispering Woods. This can be found at a less than 1% chance, so it is extremely rare, rarer than 4 Drake's base encounter, and is really difficult to fight as well, it being level 40 of course. So if you want to try and shiny hunt it, it is somewhat easy with Spooder, you know, the whole evolution line thing. But it is a, such an odd Tenorian, so why would you really want to go for it? But if you want a weird Tenorian, go ahead and try and hunt this thing, because it is certainly interesting. The second most rare Tenorian, in my opinion, is Shiny Event Dripper. Now, on the surface, it may not seem that rare, with it being 1 in 2,500, I believe, from ruptures. That being a 1 in 5 for an event rupture to be the Drippo one, and 1 in 500 inside the rupture for it to be shiny. But, it is super difficult to complete, and there's also the rupture bugs going on at the moment that limit you from doing a lot of stuff related to ruptures. So, it limits your chances, obviously, a lot of you being able to find one. Plus, the difficulty of it is going to take some skill and finesse for you to actually be. So you need to get pretty well established and not everyone is going to be willing to go for it. So in terms of trading and things, that shiny Drippo reskin has a lot of potential to become one of the rarest and most valuable Tenorians in the entire game. And the rarest Tenorian in Tales of Tenorio at this moment, and I think it's pretty obvious, is Shiny Flowerther. First of all, you have to go through a pretty difficult boss fight to unlock it, and then it is a 1 in 2 million chance base odds in the wild, which the maximum odds this can be increased to is 1 in 256,000. So this is an exceptionally rare Tenorian to obtain and hunt for, and even getting started with a chain for this thing is a challenge. So, yeah, that's basically everything in this video about some of the rarest shinies. Now, obviously, not all it's odd-based, because there's something like shiny Opaline, which is super, super rare as well, but this is kind of a compilation of my opinion for various different reasons, as I've stated. So, if you guys are going to be crazy enough to hunt for any of these, let me know in the comments below, and also let me know what your favourite shiny is. And with that, I will see you in another video. Goodbye!